welcome to the drop zone. You're about to embark on an exciting adventure, making your first skydive. Making a tandem skydive is a popular and easy way to start skydiving. During your tandem jump, you will be securely harnessed to an instructor who will guide you every step of the way. But skydiving is more than just an incredible sport. It's a welcoming community of diverse, unique, and passionate individuals. After today's jump, you'll be part of our family. So on behalf of the whole community, welcome to the sport of skydiving. Whatever your reason is for taking this leap of faith today, the moment you leave the plane will be unlike any other. Today, you will fly thousands of feet above the earth and you will experience a sensation of freedom that only skydivers know. And although tandem skydiving can be fun, it is important that you recognize and accept that there are significant risks involved. Here to tell you more about these risks, along with some important legal information, is Bill Booth who's a designer, inventor, and entrepreneur in the skydiving equipment manufacturing industry. Hello, I'm Bill Booth. I was instrumental in developing tandem jumping in the early 1980s and own uninsured United Parachute Technologies, a producer of tandem parachute equipment. Even though I've been skydiving for many years, I still fondly remember my first jump, so I know you're excited to make yours. But first, let me take a few moments to clarify the risks you assume by making a tandem parachute jump today. There is not now, nor will there ever be, a perfect parachute, a perfect parachute harnessing container, a perfect automatic activation device, a perfect airplane, a perfect pilot, a perfect parachute instructor, a perfect parachute packer, or for that matter, a perfect student. Each of these systems, or components and people all necessary for you to make a tandem parachute jump is subject to malfunction, failure to perform as expected or required, or to human error. Unexpected weather conditions may also arise. It is important that you understand that if you choose to make a parachute jump, any such malfunction, failure to perform, or change in weather conditions may cause or contribute to your injury or death. It is because of this significant inherent risk that you will be asked to sign an assumption of risk agreement. This agreement is an important legal document. It is a contract between you and all of the people and corporations that will assist you in making your tandem parachute jump. It is important that you read this document carefully and fully understand its contents. By signing this document, you expressly state that you understand that by making a tandem parachute jump, you risk serious injury or even death caused by any reason, including design or manufacturing defects, malfunction or misuse of the parachute system, or improper, careless, negligent, and in some cases, even grossly negligent use of that system by the parties involved. Simply put, signing this waiver demonstrates your willingness to accept the risk of serious injury or death in exchange for the thrill of making a tandem parachute jump. By signing this document, you also state that if you are injured or killed, neither you nor your heirs will ever sue any of the involved parties for any reason whatsoever, and that if you do sue, you promise to pay all legal expenses, costs, and attorney's fees of, or judgments against any of the sued parties. Because this document will drastically affect your legal rights, you must read it carefully and fully understand it before signing. If you do not understand its implications, you should only ask an attorney who is licensed to practice law in the state where you are jumping to explain or interpret it for you. The people assisting you with your tandem jump are not attorneys, and you may not rely on any interpretation you receive from them. If you have any questions about the specific risks involved in parachuting, we urge you to ask the drop zone personnel or read the incident reports contained in Parachutist Magazine online. Tandem is not the only way you can make a parachute jump. There are other methods of instruction available to you. This is not the only place where you may make a tandem parachute jump. This drop zone will supply you with a list of other methods or locations if you wish. If you have any medical problems that you think might affect your ability to make this jump, please ask your doctor about the advisability of your jumping and inform the drop zone personnel before signing up for your jump. 
Each drop zone has its own refund policy. So make sure that you understand what it is before paying. Now that you understand the important considerations disclosed to you, let's learn what you can expect during your tandem skydive today. Your responsibilities are very important, so listen carefully to your briefing. First, you will be helped into the harness that will secure you to the instructor. It is critical to your safety that your harness is correctly adjusted to your body. To ensure a proper fit, your instructor and possibly others involved in helping you make your jump will need to touch parts of your body at certain contact points with the harness. Your safety and comfort are essential to a great skydive. Please don't hesitate to ask any questions regarding your harness fitting process after this video. It's important to remember that a tandem jump is not a carnival ride. Because your performance can affect the outcome of the jump, you're a student, not just a passenger. Your instructor and you should ensure that the leg and chest straps of your harness are properly adjusted to your body and that you are securely hooked up to your instructor's harness prior to jumping from the aircraft. Here are USPA tandem instructors to show you the do's and don'ts for your tandem skydive. Once we put this harness on, your instructor will conduct a quick safety briefing covering what you'll need to know and do before stepping into freefall. That briefing will also provide you instruction on the correct body position for tandem skydiving, which is known as the arch position. When it's time to board the aircraft, we'll do that together. Fasten our seatbelts or restraints and enjoy the ride up to our jump altitude. During the climb to altitude, I'll attach your harness to mine and we'll make preparations before it's time to exit. How we prepare to exit the airplane and the type of exit we perform will depend on the type of aircraft we use today. Once it's our turn to jump, we'll move together toward the door and get into a crouched position. Once we're at the edge, place your hands on your harness like so, lean your head back and relax. Once I initiate the exit count, ready, set, arch, as soon as you feel the wind hit your face, give us your best freefall arch position to help us. After I deploy the parachute, then I might give you the option to pilot it. How? To go left, look left, then steer with the left toggle. To go right, look right, then steer with the right toggle. To slow down, pull both toggles down at the same time. Okay, but what if something doesn't go as planned? Great question. The number one rule is stay calm. If there is any type of emergency in the aircraft, your job is to do your best to stay calm and focus on your instructor. They'll be taking directions from the pilot and will give you instructions accordingly. If there's an emergency under canopy, stay calm. Noticing a trend? If necessary, your instructor will release the main parachute and deploy the reserve parachute. You may hear that referred to as a cutaway. Remember, the final decision on whether to make a tandem jump is yours to make. You may choose not to jump at any time, even during the aircraft flight. For your own safety, clearly communicate this decision to your instructor prior to approaching the aircraft door for exit. Keep in mind it is very normal to feel nervous before your first jump. Ready to do this? Great, let's go skydive. Just remember to arch during your jump, put your legs and feet up for landing, and relax. Your tandem skydive today is the first step to entering a whole new wonderful sport. For a lot of people, it's a life-changing experience that they cannot wait to repeat. So, don't wait. Whether you want to experience a tandem skydive again, or experience a new thrill by learning how to jump solo, talk to your drop zone personnel or visit USPA.org. It all starts with your first skydive, but it's up to you how far you'll go. No matter where this journey takes you, after today, you will always be a skydiver.